Okay guys, welcome to Monday's home workout. We are about two weeks of home training left before we can get back into the gym. Again, really like to emphasize, please try and get something done over the next two weeks. Aim for maybe three sessions a week. Again, focus on just the basic movements. A few, four or five sets of bodyweight lunges, bodyweight squats, some push-ups, some planks, some sit-ups, a bit of skipping, maybe get out for a jog, walk, get on the bike, whatever you can, just to get some sort of fitness level back up. Okay guys, so two weeks left of home workouts. Okay, so today's workout is gonna be a nice, straightforward one. What we're gonna start with is, we're gonna take our dumbbell, we're gonna go Jefferson Curl, so feet together, Tuck our chin into our chest, let that dumbbell pull us down, right as low towards our toes as we can. Deep breaths in through our nose, out through our mouth, and then hold that bottom position for a full 30 seconds. Once we've that done, we're going to gently come up, turn around, feet shoulder width apart, toes slightly pointed out to the sides, and then we're going to sit our bum right down into our heels, keeping our heels on the ground. Elbows inside our knees, drive them outwards. Chest up nice and tall. Hold 30 seconds down in the bottom of that squat. Then we're gonna come up. We're just gonna go through five tempo squats to warm it up. So stay nice and tall. Thinking about taking maybe four to five seconds on the way down. And then back up to the top. One, two, three, four. Back up to the top. We're gonna go for five reps in total. Three, two, one, and back up. Hold on to your little dumbbell for those five reps. Stay as tall as possible. Be conscious that your knees are going out, your heels are staying on the ground. Just warm up that movement. Once you've got that done, we're gonna come down to the ground. We're gonna go dog up, dog down, pigeon stretch. So push up position, drive the heels to the floor, looking down and through, hold for five seconds, chest to the ground, Squeeze our glutes, hold for five seconds, and then foot up and across. Knee down to 90 degrees, drive it to the floor, drive the chest, down towards the floor. Spend 20 to 30 seconds on that glute. Once you got the glute going on your right side, we go back into our push-up position. We go dog up, hold for five, down, hold for five, and then this time we're going to the opposite side of our pigeon stretch, getting the knee right down to the floor, driving the head and chest down and through, 20, 30 seconds on our left side. Once we got both sides done, we're gonna get into our workout. So we just have two very basic movements today, guys. We want you to really focus on range of motion, technique, speed, intensity, picking a sustainable effort throughout. Something that you can match from round one to round seven. We're gonna go 14 minutes in total, seven rounds. You got 30 seconds as many body weight squats as possible. You got 30 seconds rest. You got 30 seconds as many burpees as possible. You got 30 seconds rest. And we're going for seven rounds, 14 minutes. Every single rep you do goes towards your score. Make sure on those body weight squats, we're getting down below parallel and we're standing up fully at the top. So chest up, break parallel, stand fully at the top for the rep to count. Nose, that's not a rep. That's not a rep. They're not reps. All low reps, get right down, get all the way up. Stretch if you need to beforehand to be able to do that. Second movement on our burpee, again, think about the efficiency of the movement. We want to get our chest down to the ground as quick as possible with as little effort or energy wasted as possible. So, <coughs> getting down should look like this. Getting up should be a kick out and stand. Two movements. I'm going to come back in, chest going to come down to the ground as quick as possible. Come up. Push up, kick out, stand. What we don't want to see is <coughs> 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 Okay, 
Okay, taking way too much energy, doing a negative push up on the way down, and taking way too much energy on the way back up. Scale it back, go straight arms, go to your raised platform or your raised area as needed for those burpees. Okay guys, hope to see you on Zoom, 14 minutes, two movements, sprint pace, let's get after this one today.